it is conceivable that black holes do provide a way of, in a certain sense, going backwards in time. But let me just comment on this because going backwards in time indeed sounds impossible. But in a certain sense, it happens all the time because the modern understanding of the electron, for example, as one of the simplest elementary particles, the electron comes with a partner antiparticle, the positron. And so it's exactly the same as an electron, except it has the opposite electric charge. And uh, you can ask why are there two kind of mirror image particles of each other? And the explanation given by someone called Stuckelberg in the 1930s, very beautiful explanation, which is that according to relativity, particles travel along world line through space time. So if time goes up and space is sideways, particle will follow a line or a curve in space time. Now, when you connect relativity to quantum mechanics essentially allows everything <laughs> to happen and only assigns probabilities to so particles can walk through walls, they can do all kinds of things which were impossible classically. And what Stuckelberg thought about is can a particle reverse its direction in time?